Srimati Ramana Jainamha. A couple of days back, the Honorable Minister for Hindu Religious and Charitable Endowments Department, Tamil Nadu, had visited Sri Ranganatha Swami Temple, Sri Rangam, to have darshan of Sri Ranganatha Swami. Customarily, after his darshan, he had a press conference during which he had made a statement that the temple once had 330 acres and right now only 24 acres are available with the temple. I am not sure if the minister is well apprised of what the temple had in the past. As per a document which I have got through RTI in 2015, the temple had more than 1500 acres of wetland, dryland and groves apart from more than 2 lakh square foot of residential and commercial buildings and lands. If one goes by the minister's statement of there is only 24 acres available, where did the remaining 1500 plus acres vanish? From 2013 onwards till 2021 June, Venus Srinivasan, the business tycoon, was illegally holding the position as chairman board of trustees when the law only permits hereditary trustees to become chairmen. He being a non hereditary trustee illegally occupied the position and, and ensured that the hereditary trustees do not have a position in the board. What was he doing from 2013 to 2021 June? Was he responsible for retrieval of these lands? Was he responsible for the loss of these lands? When were these lands lost? Who had it? The minister makes a plea to the public requesting them to come forward and then pay the rents for the temple's property. But what was Venus Srinivasan doing all these days? Forget about the theft cases that I have filed on him. Will he answer to this question on where this 1500 acres have vanished? This is not a statement made by Rangaraja Narasimhan. It is a statement made by the Honorable Minister of HRNC Department, Mr. Shekhar Babu, that there are only 24 acres of land available with this temple. Where did the 1500 plus acres vanish? Mr. Venus Srinivasan, will you answer? Should he be made answerable? This is the kind of administration, maladministration that has been happening in this temple from 2013, which I am trying to expose. With his muscle power, he has been escaping all these days. Now that the minister himself has said this. Let's see if he will answer these questions. Shri Mathihara Manu Jai